The visitor beyond the stars has returned. An interstellar wanderer has come back to us once more, brighter than before, clearer than ever, more mesmerizing with every captured photon. The James Webb Space Telescope has turned its golden eye toward the unknown. And what it has seen shakes the foundations of science and imagination alike. For the first time, we have a sharp, detailed portrait of 3i, Atlas, only the third interstellar visitor ever discovered. First came Oumuamua, a fleeting enigma, strange, silent, and gone before we could truly know it. Then came 2i, Borisov, an icy messenger trailing familiar cometary breath. And now, this, a traveler from a forgotten sun. Unlike the visitors before it, Webb revealed this object in astonishing clarity. No blur. No streak. No uncertain data. A true portrait, radiant, haunting, impossibly real. We are not simply watching a rock drift through space. We are witnessing the memory of another star. Its surface is ancient and fractured, sculpted by collisions older than human history. A ghostly halo wraps around it in reflected light, a whisper from a time before worlds like ours existed. Infrared imaging reveals ridges, scars, and deep fractures. Every mark tells a story, storms survived, impacts endured, the slow erosion of cosmic time. Unlike Oumuamua, 3i, Atlas is rugged, jagged, and defiant, a survivor of extremes. Spectral scans reveal frozen carbon, silicates, and complex organic molecules. Ingredients tied to life, scattered across the galaxy like seeds on the wind. The control room fell silent. Everyone understood the truth. This object was not born under our sun. It is a relic from another system, a wanderer of the dark for millions of years. Its path carved by gravity and guided by chance until destiny placed it within Webb's gaze. Deep beneath its icy crust, faint warmth lingers, perhaps from radioactive decay, perhaps from slow, uneven rotation. A quiet heartbeat from a long-lost home. First spotted by the Atlas survey, its orbit confirmed the impossible, it came from beyond the sun. Webb's mirrors cut through darkness and distance, revealing chemistry that points to a birth around a fading red dwarf star, a message written in dust and starlight. Its reddish glow comes from tholines, complex organic compounds found on distant moons and comets. If such molecules can survive the void between stars, then the universe may scatter the seeds of life far and wide. 3i, ATLAS rotates unevenly a fragile cluster of rock and ice held together by gravity and silence. Webb detected faint jets of vapor, proof that it still breathes in the cold. Every observation pushes the limits of our understanding of how worlds form, shatter, and drift. This image is more than data. It is a whisper across the stars. 3i, Atlas is no mere comet. It was forged under another sky. Its chemistry shaped by storms older than Earth. Its surface etched by cosmic rays. Its dust fused by time. In false color, it glows crimson and bronze, the fingerprints of tholines, molecules that may one day spark life. It tumbles softly, hollow in places, a gathering of ancient fragments. Even sunlight awakens halos of vapor, as if memories still cling to its frozen skin. Scientists were astonished. A visitor from another system, still active, still alive, a heartbeat from a long-lost sun. If many such wanderers exist, then every solar system becomes a storyteller, sharing fragments across the galaxy. A cosmic network carrying the chemistry of life itself. 3i, ATLAS may once have been part of a world. Now it drifts alone, carrying the memory of its lost home. Each photon web captured crossed interstellar time, a meeting between nature and human creation. 
Webb's triumph is as human as it is scientific. From the first stargazers to a telescope that touches another world, exploration continues. And even as 3i, ATLAS fades back into the dark, its image remains. A symbol of connection, a reminder that every fragment carries a story. Through those stories, we uncover.